23 sat under me and my stance on it is I have zero tolerance. We have a handbook and it's written into the handbook, zero, zero tolerance on bullying because it happened to me when I was working as a criminal and it is ridiculous and I think the way out of it is communication. Um, we even stopped having staff meetings because we found that even that would even gear up a lot of gossiping. So what we do is one-on-ones every six to eight weeks where you give some quieter people an opportunity to actually come and talk to you um, if there is something happening. But I think when you were saying even that like oh, every case is different, I think as an employer, if you start out with zero, zero tolerance, that's nipped it in the bud. And I, it is easy, even though some people might find it, it is easy. I work with a lot of people, a lot of young people mm -hmm. who, yeah, it can be a little bit like that sometimes. And I think that there's a big difference between doing it with your safe space, with your friends, in the workplace, zero tolerance. So you have it written down in your handbook for oh, your specific work and you have to have that in place. And you can fire people over. It's simple yeah. as it's not part of the guidelines of where we work. And that's not the that's standard, it. but zero and tolerance. And is there three strikes and you're out, or is it just, no, we don't put up with it at Written all? warning and then gone. Yeah. Literally, you're in probation for about three months and then you're gone. And I have been, I suppose, unfortunate situations and very much in the past where I've had to call upon that. Yeah. And like, literally, I have... I cannot stand it. I can't stand seeing another person going through that. Mm -hmm. And what one person might find is kind of like, okay, thicker skin, it can actually ruin a person's life. Mm -hmm. Their confidence is down. They won't, if I suffer, because they won't come into work, next thing I have a doctor's note because someone has severe anxiety because they've been, they've been talked about at work. Mm -hmm. So that's why it will actually affect my business. And I'm so happy to see countries like Australia bring this in. Yeah. They bring this in. Yeah. Um, when it happened to you, is that the age were you? I was 19. Oh, God. Now, it gave me the drive. I'm lucky it gave me the drive how, to go on to succeed. Um, I stopped working. I was that girl who stopped working. I the job, and it was because it was nitpicky, and it developed. And now that I'm an adult, I look back, and I can see it was horrific. Do they have, a, like, a wish to be sacked? Or yeah. Well, it's because they're, they're a publisher. They're a publisher. It can be defamation. You're